Oh man, good evening people. Good evening. Good evening everyone. I need time for myself. These cats, man, they're uh I got home a little late, about five o'clock. Cause it took me a long time to walk and I went to donate and the machine kept on messing up, which took me like a whole extra hour almost. Um, and it wasn't even really the machine. It was the people working today, they were just slow. Like people were done with their plasma and like sat there for a half an hour with the needle in the arm after the machine already shut off. Like, that's not cool. Like, that's not good. Like, dude's arm can, that's not good. You can't leave a needle in that long. You know what I mean? People, man, people are fucked up, but I got home, man, and the cats are bad, dude. And I wanted to bring little one with me, but it would have died, you know? And I wouldn't have been able to take it in there with me, and I don't have nobody to watch them. Nobody's, you know, taking care of them and stuff. But uh, I got here, man, and thankfully, fucking Broham Bill, bro, fucking brought some cat food and brought me some antibiotics, man. It was only one, but you know, it's something. I took half the pill and threw it in the milk and the water and let it dissolve. They were, they're, they're, they're bad. Their nose, their their nose is starting to drain like the gray one, and that gray one passed away last night. So I gotta do something, man. I I I gave them antibiotics, and they had the chills, you know. They're run down, so they were shaking, you know. And you could tell they were cold, you know. They had the chills, so I threw them in. I actually got in the bathtub with them. I'm exhausted too. Every time I donate plasma, I get like this. I don't like donating, but I do it to help people. And then there's a lady there that uh, I like to go see. She's an older lady, and I'm kind of glad that I went because she was happy to see me. And uh, we talked about some yoga stuff because she's been having some back problems. You know, she's she's got to be in her 50s, you know. And uh, she told me that she. Out of all the people that come up there, she actually, like, looks for me <laughs> to see, like, to poke me. I'm like, that's cool. Thanks. <laughs> she just says she enjoys her conversations. That's what it is. But I, uh, I peeped her up on game, put her up on game, man, and, uh, told her about the yoga, and, you know, and she said that everybody, she said other people have told her about yoga, but she said the people that they told her, they're, they're not believable people, you know, they're not people that you would take any information from and really believe, believe it, so, you know, she knows who I am, you know, she knows, you know, she's seen my stomach too, you know, she's, she's seen my body, so, she knows I'm not, you know, like, I'm serious when I'm telling her something, you know, and uh, so that was cool, you know, she, but she ended up leaving and she told me she needed, she asked me if I had a, uh, randomly asked me if I had a, 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 um, oh my God, I can't even think of it, a smoothie maker, a damn ice machine, you know, uh, oh my God, a blender, couldn't even get it out of my mouth. She asked me if I had a blender, which is weird as I do, and I told her I'd give it to her, like, that's odd that you were asking for a blender and I have one. You know, and I don't use it. It's not odd, it's Jesus. So I told her she could have it. And then just now, so this morning, last night I got a call, message from Facebook from my air mattress. I had it listed for 30 bucks. Dude messages me, tries to get me to come get it at like 9 o'clock this morning. I was already out the door, you know. I told him, look, dude, you're going to have to wait till 3, you know, 3. That's when I thought I was going to be home. I didn't get home till 5. And then... I told him, like, dude, I'm here, you know, you come get it. And he's like, is there any way I can call you? I'm like, sure, you know, like, here, here's my number, call me, right? He calls me, right? And is like, bro, he's like, my girlfriend just broke into my house. 
and took everything of mine and ran off with it. Everything, furniture, all that shit while I was at work. I'm like, that's some whole ass shit, bro. He's like, is there any way I can trade you something for that mattress? Air mattress. I was like, bro, come and get it. I'm like, on Jesus, it's on Jesus, bro. Just come and get it. Just, it's on the porch. I didn't even want, I feel bad not even wanting to like shake his hand or seeing him, but I'm exhausted, dude. I, I'm surprised I'm even up. I'm only doing a video right now because I said I would do a video and I didn't think this was gonna happen. I know I get tired, but I know what it is too, is I know I gotta get up in the middle of the night, keep my routine. And I know I'm gonna have to not, I'm gonna have to get up between my, my sleep schedule to feed these cats and check up on them. So that's kind of why I'm stressed out. So um, what I'm gonna do is lay down and get some rest. When I wake up to feed these cats, we'll do a Bible study because I gotta get it in. Um, you know, you guys are on your own right now as far as yoga goes. It's not hard to look up the stuff on the internet. All you're doing is stretching on your back and you're meditating and you're, you're breathing with your stomach, your diaphragm. It just takes practice balance, you know, but it'll be the best thing physically and spiritually ever that'll ever happen to you. So get on it if that's something you want to try, you know. But I'm gonna let you guys go. I got. I'm exhausted. I'm gonna go. I. I gotta get some rest, man. I got the fan blowing. My room's fucking trashed. I got a fucking torch in my room like a crackhead. Cause, yeah, I'm a crackhead. <laughs> I'm ready to go to bed. That's all I know. I don't even really. I smoked a roach. I, I'm so like exhausted. I don't even want to. I don't even want to smoke and roll a joint. I just want to go to bed. That's what I'm gonna do. So. uh... I'll talk to you guys tonight when I wake up from the dud. Peace out.